So how would you describe cultural conditioning? So cultural conditioning, like you mentioned earlier, it, you're teaching the dog. If the dog is being good, you give them a treat, and then the dog will continue in that particular behavior. Or if the kid, you tell them to be quiet, and if they're quiet, you give them a cookie, they're going to know that when they're quiet, more cookies are coming. So it's very much like that. It's a behavior that is cyclical. I think when it comes from a cultural setting, that people won't look at you in a different light. But when you do, when you do act out of, I guess, the norm of culture, that's when people are giving you the side eye or they're looking at you like, what's she doing? It's strange. Why is she talking like that? Why is she behaving outside of what we consider standard or normal? We still see that with <laughs> treatment against women. Why aren't you married? Why do you have kids? You know, all the other aspects. I am not a fan of that. <laughs> <laughs> 